Ariel Helwani post fight at UFC 148 alongside Mike Easton, who defeated Ivan Menjivar tonight. And Mike, it seemed outside into the arena, the fans getting a little restless. What did you think of the fight overall? I thought it was a good fight. Uh, action, of course, when we when, when we got in in the mix, but he stayed on the outside. He obviously, he definitely felt my power tonight, and he fought on the outside. So it was I had to work my way on the inside and do whatever it is, do whatever it takes to get the win. Seems like you're happy with it. You got a big yeah, smile on your yeah. face. Always to get a win in the UFC is always important. And then I got the fight on pay-per-view. Yeah. And it's, it's a real good feeling. I got to represent my team, Team Lloyd Irvin, Alliance Gym. Feel awesome about that. And I got to represent my city, DC, Maryland, Virginia, of course, in the DMV. I love it. By the way, I'm not a huge fan of this right here. That W. I know. Please don't tell me that's the Nationals. Yes, it has to be. It's Come on, man. I, I, it's I'm my an Expos team. guy. You took my, you broke my heart. I apologize for that. I'm so sorry about that, but I got to represent my team, man. And I love Washington, D.C. That's my hometown. Now back to the fight and back to your fighting. You haven't fought since January, had some injuries. How good does it feel to feel like you're now back on track? Felt real good. Felt real, real good. Of course, you have your little bumps and bruises. We're going to get that taken care of so I can get back in the cage and fight again as soon as possible. Were you 100% going into this fight? Yeah, I, I felt I felt, I felt, felt pretty good, actually. I felt real good. Of course, you got your little knickknacks in there, but other than that, I felt great. Obviously, we know about your relationship with Dominic Cruz. He's out for at least a year or so due to an injury. Is this your opening to try to be a champion here? Because you didn't want to fight him. Yeah, I mean, no, me and Dom, me and Dom, me and Dom slug it out. We, we oh, slug yeah. it out. Man, we slug it out all the time anyway in the gym. That's awesome. No, no, no one, everybody on teams always talk about, oh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't fight my friend. No, we have to. It would be disrespectful to Dom to not even fight him because he's the champ and the warrior that he is. It'd be it it'd just be honorable. Wow. And no one no one has ever done that before. Nobody. And we'll still be on the same team, wear the same flags, and man, we'll, we'll slug it out, give a show to the fans. Well, that is very commendable. How close do you think you are to a title shot? We've got, of course, a big one coming up in the division 149. I definitely know I'll work my way up, and I know I'm real close to getting that title shot. And I, I would love it. You know me. I'm all, I'm all about fighting. I love to fight. And you, you saw that tonight. And uh, hey, whatever it takes, I want, I want that belt. I want to get it. Congrats, Mike. Thank you. I appreciate it.